Chris Dole in his happy place. When he's not designing electric vehicles for a major car maker, he's at home tinkering in his workshop. I've been building all sorts of crazy wacky inventions and this is essentially my latest creation. A homemade e-bike, but with a very special variation to its voltage. And these are what I use to power the e-bike. Disposable, single-use vape pens. Each has a lithium-ion battery that can be reused potentially hundreds of times. Especially as they're marketed as disposable, everyone thinks that they are inherently built of disposable components and we're throwing away rare earth materials uh, that quite frankly absolutely should not be going in the landfill. It's estimated almost 5 million vapes are thrown away in the UK every week, most in the trash or on sidewalks. Almost all my friends and family, every time I, I see them from another city, they'll hand me a, a bag of just all these vapes that they've collected just from walking around. It's foraging for, for gold in my eyes because these are so valuable. It took Dole six weeks to combine 130 of them to get this. There we go. A battery unit that he says can take the bike on quite a commute. So we'll power it up. Without any pedalling, I got it to 32 kilometres. So with pedalling, probably push about 50. There you are. Time for a test drive then. Wow, that's pretty impressive. 130 vape pens are powering me and I am moving, really moving. To avoid the risk of fire, Dole warns not to try this at home. <laughs> Next up, he wants to make a power wall from vapes for his workshop, but time is running out. Single-use vapes will be banned in the UK next year. Dole thinks that can't come soon enough. Redmond Shannon, Global News, Rugby, England.